Chipa United appoint Given Hunt, Atletico Madrid snap up Banyana striker, and Kaiser Chiefs lose out on Tertius Malepe. Hey guys, welcome to the Wars and Other Transfer Show, and let's get into the latest happenings in the PSL. <laughs> We kick off the episode as Bloemfontein tie down Masuku. Bloemfontein Celtics have confirmed that Menzi Masuku will remain at the club for three more years. Masuku signed on the dotted line on a three year deal with Punye Selesele. With his contract extension seeing him with the Bloemfontein outfit until June 2024. Celtics announced the extension on their Twitter account with the statement Bloemfontein Celtic is delighted to announce that Menzi Masuku has extended his stay with the club until June 2024. The journey continues. Our next few stories takes us to the Chile boys as Chipper sign Malian midfielder. Chipper United have announced their first signing ahead of the new season with the Chile boys bringing in Jomo Sonos, Malian midfielder Abubakar Bame Senangre. Senangre signed a three-year deal to join Chipa. Staying with the Chile boys as Chipa's hunt is over with Chipa United confirming that Gavin Hunt will take the reins. Gavin Hunt has been confirmed as the next Chipa United coach. His appointment was announced today by the Chipper United chairman and it's believed that the ex-Kaiser Chiefs coach has agreed a two-year contract. Given Hunt's appointment comes after the departure of Lesolonolo Siema who has joined Golden Arrows. Hunt spent eight months at Amakosi before the two parties went their separate ways. The Chile boys put out a statement welcoming the head coach. Chipper United Footballing Club is pleased to announce the appointment of Gavin Hunt as the club's new head coach. Welcome to the Eastern Cape, the home of the Chile Boys. From Chipper, we shift our interest to Amazulu as Mosonda closing in on a DSTV Prem return. Zambian international Mwapwe Musonda is set for a return to Mzanzi with a DSTV Premiership outfit expressing their interest in the services of the lethal striker. Amazulu have identified Musonda as a transfer target, with Usutu having confirmed that the former Black Leopards striker is top of their list of targets to bring to the KwaZulu Natal Giants. With the Durban based club expected to finalize a deal for the attacker in the upcoming days. Yep guys, please let me know in the comments below, do you think Mapwe Musonda would be a great addition to Amazulu. Staying in the kingdom of the Zulu is Usutu Steel Kaiser Chiefs target. Former Orlando Pirates defender Tertius Malepe is set to complete a return to South Africa after reaching an agreement to join Amazulu. The 24 year old defender is said to have penned a three year deal with Benny McCarthy's side with an official announcement imminent. It was understood that preliminary discussions were held previously regarding a move to join Kaiser Chiefs, but these negotiations fell to the wayside with Amazulu stepping up their pursuit in signing the under 23 Bafana Bafana captain. Our next story takes us abroad as Atleti snap up Banyana striker. Banyana Banyana striker Tembi Katlana has signed a two year deal with Spanish giants Atletico Madrid. Katlana joins Atleti after spending a single season with Spanish Bayside Aiba, where she shone scoring 10 goals in 21 league games, which led Atleti to chasing her signature. The South African international arrives to reinforce the Rochi Blancos attack as Katlana continues to break barriers after winning the 2018 CAF African Footballer of the Year and then catching the eye at the 2019 FIFA World Cup. I'm very happy to arrive at Atletico de Madrid. As a footballer, it's always a dream to play for the best clubs. What a massive achievement for one of the best South African female footballers making their strides abroad. Congratulations to Tembi on getting such a big move and hopefully she lights up La Liga. Newly promoted DSTV Premiership side Sikukune United have unveiled five new players. With the DSTV new boys making signings from the likes of Barocca, Jomo Cosmos, 
Tears Galaxy and Marumo Gallants. A big name from the five signings unveiled is Tabo Rachale, with the former Orlando Pirates man said to be the marquee signing of Sikukune. But sources have revealed that Sikukune have now turned their attention to Mamelodi Sundown's Nicolas Lukubeni, with the club signaling their intentions to hold talks with the 25 year old as they look to bring him on on loan. Yep guys, this is all we have for the episode. Please don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next episode.